What's up guys, Pro Tip Monday here on my YouTube channel and in today's video we are going to make like a little experiment and I don't know if you guys love experiments, I do. It is about measuring temperature and thermometers in aquariums. I'm not a huge fan of measuring temperature in my aquariums because at my space I just set the most of them just for the room temperature. It's quite warm and cozy here for the most time of the year. However, if I have to set the temperature with a heater or a thermal filter, I usually do 24 degrees Celsius, which is 75 degrees Fahrenheit. But if you need a thermometer and sometimes you want to check the uh, temperature, you can use like a digital device um, or you can use one of the classic thermometers. And I have a couple of them here. So you get one of these uh, basic thermometer with a suction cup. You put it inside and yeah, not very nice. Uh, then you have one of these. That one looks better, but also costs a little bit more, like a hang-on thermometer. And then you have some of these sticky type thermometers. Maybe you know them from many years ago uh, when you started with a hobby. At least one of these was one of my first thermometers, the sticky type thermometer, when I started uh, with the fish keeping uh, like 20 years ago. They're not very accurate, but uh, they get the job done to give you an estimate of what's going on temperature-wise in your aquarium. So, coming to the experiment, um, I've been thinking like I want to keep the thermometer out of the aquarium and I had this idea for a very, very long time. So I've been thinking to find a mini version of this thermometer and glue it into a lily pipe, like an inline thermometer. But gluing thermometers inside of a lily pipe, I guess, is a little bit tricky. It's going to be messy with silicone and then, you know, maybe with all the dirt and cleaning and also it takes quite a lot of space, so I think that would even reduce the flow and I definitely don't want to reduce the flow uh, coming into my filter or coming out from the filter whatsoever. And then I was thinking maybe one of these could be attached on the outside, like, you know, banded and attached on the outside of the lily pipe. Not the nicest version, I agree, but that would give me an inline thermometer. And I, I discussed this uh, with a friend of mine and he said, Yuris, if you have it on the outside of your tank, that's going to be affected by the room temperature because like 50% room temperature, 50% tank temperature and both is having uh, an effect on this one. So like right now it's measuring room temperature. I thought, hey, why don't I put this one on the inside of the lily pipe and because of the band it should hold in by itself. So without any further ado, let's get into the experiment. Take this one, put it inside here and see if I can measure the temperature with the very first, maybe, inline thermometer in a lily pipe. It's an experiment, it's fun. We will see, we will find out. So let's get started. Here I have this tiny little thermometer and uh, before I put it inside the lily pipe, on the back side is this protection paper uh, because of the yeah, sticky surface. For safety reasons, I would recommend removing it. So to remove it, you can use, I think alcohol, like acetone, something like nail polish remover, stuff like that, or you can buy even like a glue removal and uh, then you just remove it from the back side, make sure to clean it and maybe yeah, give it a little dip in uh, something like Sikkim Prime, something that's going to neutralize all the dangerous chemicals and then you're good to use it in the lily pipe uh, where it has actually contact with water. And then we're just going to bend it a little bit and insert inside the lily pipe just like this. And guys, what's really cool on its own, I have like a little extra space on the front side of the sticker. I don't know if you can see this, but the water can actually flow on the back and on the front of this sticky type thermometer. Uh, I don't know, the lily pipe looks a little bit ugly <laughs> by now, uh, but hey, I have uh, created my inline thermometer like I wanted. That's it for today's pro tip, that little experiment or hack, I don't know, let me know how you like stuff like this, a little bit experimental without knowing where it is going to lead to. Um, I hope you like this video and I'm gonna see you in the next one. 